This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here for the Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update on this Monday, the 22nd of May. We're going to get the Dow down 116 points at 33,309. Well, you know the pattern that we always look for is when you come down sharply, try to bounce, fade at a peak A or B, come down, retest the left side low. If it's successful, it can have another little bounce, and they can go from a lowercase h pattern to a lowercase m. That's exactly what we're seeing right here uh, in the Dow. And this is going to make the uh, 33,100 level really important to hold on a near-term basis, but 32,900 is absolutely key this week to hold. Looking at the S&P, and I would not be surprised to see if the S&P has given back much of the earlier gain. Yes, it has. It had 42.09, made a lower high than on Friday. And this, I, there's no other way I could count it. This is the PC. It allows room for at least one more spike up into the Shadow Wave inside track repellent zone. So you're at 41.95. Any time this week, if there's a close, it can't just be a spike. This time I need a close about 42.53. That'll be a very nice breakout. But definitely the 41, I would say at this particular point, 41.50 support is really important to hold. QQQ, NDX 100, doing really nicely up a dollar 83 at 338.39 in my show coming up, the Tiger Technicians Hour. I'll talk about this left side, right side price time match. That is price symmetry from the 334.42 high of August of last year. Comes plunging down to 254. And what happened? One week late it came right to the 334 level, spiked above it, now slightly higher. I'll talk about the IWM as well. The IWM is the Russell 2000. It went to a sharp move up yes, on Friday. It's pulling back a little bit today. It's already the laggard. Looking at the gold contract, gold has uh, been pulling back. It's now down 9 at uh, 1973, I think the support that I pointed out last week when I did the show on Tuesday, um, that 1950s is really going to be important support. Looking at the TLT, let's go to bonds right now. Our bonds really took a dive, and they're actually further down. They're down for 30 seconds at 127. I'm going to say to you that the yields are in that range, and it's going to be important. And crude oil, I do, as we're wrapping up this particular update, Crude oil is uh, down, just a little bit down, a few cents, uh, stuck in the low range. That's what's happening. Thank you.